It's day 119 in a year of living the warrior's way. Today I want to talk about perception and reality. So here we are in my workshop where we clean and resell sofas. And your perception would be, oh, well, that's all very nice. It looks good. You know, there's nice pictures, there's nice things. But the reality is quite different. When you step away and you look at things, you can see it's a constructed reality. And when you look around a little bit more, you can see the dirt, you can see the work, you can see what needs to happen. Now, the interesting point here is, and what this has to do with warrior, is our realities are created in our brains. We can create false realities. We can create false stories. We can create false illusions. For example, this used to be my partner's business. I helped build it for her and with her from scratch, from nothing. Very profitable, very, very good business. But I have taken over the business with her help. And it, basically, I reply as if I am her. And let me tell you, when you're responding to messages from women, it's very, very different if you're responding to a message as a man. Because as a man, we wouldn't put lots of kisses, we wouldn't put lots of hearts, we wouldn't put lots of gems and smiley faces and all of this stuff. But women, they love all that shit. They put hearts and claps and woohoos and all of these lovely celebratory emojis and they think it's normal and natural. And their reality is that. But as a man trying to reply, pretending, also not pretending to be a woman, but because what we've discovered is people will buy a sofa from her, but they won't buy it from me. Women, this is. They'd rather deal with a woman. So I have to create a facade of pretending to be a woman. Now, if I was dealing with a man, very, very different thing, because a man would be straight to the point, how much is it? When can I be delivered? Blah, blah, blah. A woman has to do 96 messages. <laughs> this is what I'm experiencing. So it's all good fun, but it just changes the perception of what the reality is for that person. I mean, Warrior, one of the things that we do, one of the tools that we have is that stack, which allows us to ask ourselves a series of questions so that we can actually create our own reality rather than relying on what we can see, what we perceive and what we think is the actual truth. We get into what is the actual truth. Cheers.